So I made it to Rune Mountain Knob Shelter. That's it there. And uh, let's see, lobsters in there, huddles in there, local, Sonic, Waywalker, No Name, Tigger. Yeah, they're all here tonight. But they want to do 20 tomorrow. I'm not so sure. Looks like it's the site of an old fire tower too. Maybe that was originally the warden's cabin. Nice day today. It's going to be a beautiful day. Most of the day tomorrow, but some thunderstorms possibly. Tennessee Mountains. Laurel Creek. Oh wow. I just looked up. Wow. We're not going up that way. But we are crossing. Oh my goodness, I don't remember this. Canyon carved out here. Ooh, that is straight up. Hey everybody, well today I am moving into Hampton, Tennessee. It is a gray, rainy, foggy day, but I only have six miles. I'm going to go to Boots Off Hostel so I can get a shower and uh, wash my clothes and get some uh, resupply. And that's my day today. Little rainy. Oh my. Ooh. Hello everybody. So I'm out here. I just had to show this fog. Trail is like straight straight up there. Yeah, this whole place is just one big fog cloud. So I realized while walking down the trail that this is my one month anniversary on the trail. What a way to celebrate trapped in this fog. Hasn't been bad. I think the worst thing that I would complain about, but who's complaining, is the cold, which I mention a lot, I know. But it's the cold and the wind. You know, today's rainy, but it's in the 50s, it's not bad. And then I've got three days into Damascus, which is gonna to be tough because those are gonna be cold days. It's supposed to be like 26 or something like that. But those days are few and far between anymore, so I'm liking that. Check this out. Came down that trail there and just looked off to my right. It's Wataga Lake. 
Yeah, so the hostel is down there somewhere. So I have a couple more miles in this uh, fog, although it's not raining. Well, it's my 34th day. I probably look a little tired. I uh, didn't sleep well last night. I was in a shelter with three other snoring guys. And apparently I do snore. So make that five guys snoring. Um, it's just weird out here. And if you can see there's, there's some snow. Yesterday there was a lot of snow. And uh, two days ago, it was like 75 degrees in shorts. Weird. Got a dress for everything out here, I tell you. Big thing is trying to stay dry, get all sweaty. It's 29 degrees out, so you get all sweaty. You stop, boy, that gets cold. But as long as you got something dry to put on that you have, get in your sleeping bag like I did yesterday. We did 16 and a half miles before two o'clock in the afternoon. That's ridiculous. So today, today we have another 16 to do. And then that would leave 10 on Saturday to get me into Damascus. Well, I don't know, it's supposed to be an easy hike. I was thinking about going all the way into Damascus and just get a room for the night. It would be 26. Uh, we'll see. But Damascus would be a nice break. Kind of nursing a uh, shin splint right now. It hurts. So, day off would be good. On the trail in Tennessee, just came across this. Hiking with Tigger here. Pretty you? Yeah, man. It's a really nice trail. This actual part of the trail is handicap accessible. And it's not all that long. It's, and then uh, you can see the weather there rolling in. Well, actually rolling around because it's been with us all day. Yeah, it's not just me, is it? Huh? Nothing finer. <laughs> Snow flurries. I don't know if you can see them. You got you to gotta laugh because you can't cry. Nobody here to listen. Yeah. <laughs> can you hear them? That's true. You start to lose your mind out here. Walking down the snowy trail here in Tennessee. Probably can't see him, but huddles up there. Another mile to the shelter. We're gonna take our lunch break. So we all just decided to hold up at the Abingdon Shelter, which is another eight miles up. We'll get there around three. Then we'll have a 10 mile hike into Damascus tomorrow. Here's McQueen's shelter. It's one of the oldest on the AT. I think it was built in 1938. And there's lobster. The shelter we're staying at tonight is about a mile up. But you can see how primitive this thing is. Wow. Not much protection here. Pulled into Abingdon Shelter. It's one of the last shelters in Tennessee. They are all the same. They're very simple structures. We'll cross into Virginia tomorrow. Um, so far, I'm gonna be with the same guys as last night. Tigger's here. 
Lobsters here, you can see his, his hammock is set up, which we love because it brought, blocks the wind. We already have another stranger here today. It's our snowman. But yeah, a lot of snow. Puddles coming and uh, no name too. But we all getting set up in here. There it is, it's my, that's my spot over there. Tigger's next to me. So Tigger, how do you stop the snoring in the shelter? It works. In the middle of the night, everybody stops. <laughs> Coming into Damascus. This is where they have trail days every year. It's pretty special. Like hundreds and hundreds of hikers gather and suppliers. And it's supposed to be a pretty cool thing. So I know my boys just uh, got into town. I gotta look them up. Here's an example of shelters. Damascus has to offer.